In this video, we'll talk about Brain Power and Brain Health 101. The advantages of finding your true north are numerous. It enhances your chances of being comfortable in your skin and finding your best niche. The perks of starting with clarity include the following. Define goals. There's no way you'll be able to set specific goals when you don't have a clear idea of what you want to do. You only end up setting targets that are ambiguous based on questionable criteria. When people ask you how you intend to achieve the goal, you might find yourself shocked because you'll realize that you haven't thought things through. Some individuals will accuse others of being pessimistic for questioning the feasibility of their dreams. Don't be deceived. It's not everyone that questions you that doesn't believe in you. There are times that your friends will realize that you're only aiming to reach a target based on the wrong motives. It might be obvious to them that you don't have a plan and your goals are not realistic. Don't start fighting them and accusing them, especially when they are constructive in their criticism. Ask them what they think are the missing gaps so that you can go to the drawing board together and start all over again. It's better to start again than embark on a fruitless and meaningless endeavor that is doomed to fail. Clear Direction When you start with clarity, you know where you are heading. Apart from knowing the direction of where you want to go, you'll also be able to give details of how you'll get there and the sacrifices you will need to pay to reach the target. When you don't have a clue about what it takes to achieve a goal, you'll be surprised somewhere along the line and will realize that you've not prepared ahead. Being mentally prepared is the most important readiness you need to scale through potential challenges. When you don't know what to expect, your mental strength might not be enough to see you through. Your skills and expertise cannot always bail you out. If you're not prepared for what is coming ahead, you might collapse and give up. So, it's crucial that you start a journey with a good grasp of what to expect. You should be able to highlight the risks and potential challenges you might face to a reasonable extent. When this is missing, you'll eventually find yourself in no man's land and might have to start all over again. A sense of meaning. Nothing beats that feeling of waking up in the morning and you feel that you're living a meaningful life. When your life doesn't make sense to you, you'll feel like staying in bed all day long. In the worst case, you might be considering suicide because you cannot fathom why you're living. Don't wait until things get so bad that you have suicidal ideations. Draft a plan for your life. Sit down and draft a plan for your life. Ask yourself, who am I? What kind of man or woman would you like to become? The earlier you find answers to these questions, the better for you. When you don't have a plan for your life, others will use you to achieve theirs. You should have values that resonate with your personality and set your goals based on them. How do you see the world? What can you contribute to make life worthwhile for others? What can you do that will make you feel that you are doing far more than just existing? Provide answers to these questions as soon as possible to give yourself an essence to live. Identification of distractions. It's when you know where you're going and what you need to do that you can be able to identify potential distractions. For example, when you're playing football, the aim is to score against the opponent and prevent the opponent from putting the ball in your net. Anything that prevents you from achieving these two objectives isn't worth it. In the same way, when you have a clear plan for your life, you'll be able to tell when you are deviating from the original plan. It's a disaster when an individual is already going astray and he or she cannot tell. You cannot plan to become a successful real estate agent and you spend most of your time reading about the latest fashion trends. How is that supposed to contribute to your target? It's not as though you should never do anything else with your time when you have a goal. Still, you need to devote quality time to your primary assignment. Resilience. You can only stay strong and keep pushing when you're sure that you want to achieve is worth it. When you're not convinced that what you're trying to attain will give you the ultimate satisfaction at the end of the day, you'll break down at the slightest side of a storm. It's your vision of how what you intend to achieve will make you feel in the long run that will keep you focused when things are not going your way. Every career path has its unique challenges. In fact, you'll have reasons to be disappointed with the people around you at one point or the other, regardless of how much you love them or they love you. What will keep you going during those turbulent days is the reason you decided to venture into the endeavor in the first place. That's why it's essential that you have genuinely solid reasons for doing something. Compassion. You don't only need compassion for others, you also need it for yourself. You'll fall at some point because no one is infallible. When you start out with clarity, you'll also realize that it's possible to make mistakes at some point. You would have also planned what you will do in case that day comes. When you don't plan ahead to forgive yourself and others, you'll struggle to do so when things go bad. 
Plan ahead to overlook your flaws and forgive yourself to give yourself the impetus to start over again or continue when you fail. Life doesn't always go in the direction of your plan. You should have positive expectations. So if things are always going on smoothly, you need to check what you are doing. It is likely that you are doing less than your ability. Positive self-image. A clear view of how you want to proceed makes you feel good about yourself. It gives you the impression that you're in control and taking responsibility for your life. No one wants to feel that he or she doesn't have a direction in life. It can ruin your self-esteem and affect your confidence. Meanwhile, low self-esteem will make you settle for less than you deserve. You'll be happy with average performance and feel that you are outdoing yourself when you are not taking full advantage of your potential. Indeed, you should have a realistic evaluation of yourself. Still, you shouldn't settle for just anything that comes your way in life. When life doesn't give you what you want and deserve, refuse to take it. Stage a comeback and demand what you deserve. Of course, it is easier said than done. However, when you start out with clarity, you know what you want and will not settle for less. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.